The whole place got destroyed. Look at the houses. That house there is mine. It's so ruined. Don't be afraid. Come down. Easy, madam. Come on, lift it up. One, two, three. Come on, trust Allah. We were surprised in a Manaro neighborhood in particular, which is on Nafak Street. It started raining heavily suddenly. The water started to get into the houses. We left everything as it is. My whole family is homeless now, living in these schools. As you see, we call upon the Arab nation to stand by us. As a response from Interpol in the recent winter crisis, in the recent storm, Interpol intervened in many ways. First, Interpol visited affected families in all over the Gaza Strip and provided them with the basic needs, such as food, parcels, blankets, scarves, jackets, and other clothes. While we were sleeping, water leaked into our beds and sheets. They all became wet and so cold for the children to sleep in. There was no heater, no suitable winter clothes. We're only waiting for the help of charity people. May Allah bless them for the donors' urgent help. The storm was so strong that we've never experienced such a thing in years. And as you can see, Actually, my son got ill one time, and they stood by my side during the building process and everything. May Allah bless them. We face a horrible coldness and unexpected heavy rain. And as you see, I was hoping for having a piece of wood just to make some fire, to bring some warmth to my children. The ceiling was ripped off and the water got into the house. They were very hard days. These days were much harder than the last two wars. Then Interpol started to help different schools, which are affected by the recent winter storm, to help its students with their basic needs such as jackets, shoes and scarves. Interpal is working now on another financial aid for its 5,695 sponsored beneficiaries who are between needy orphans, needy families and needy disabled children for giving them the chance to buy what they need in this winter. All of these efforts are the result of your donation. Despite of all of this, the needs are much bigger than that. This is only a primitive emergency response. In the next stage, Interpal is seeking for helping, inshallah, their needs in a long-term effect, like con contribution in the reconstruction of their houses, the houses of the affected people, and other related issues. So please donate more and more to help Palestinians who are still suffering to give them the chance to have a decent home.